What's up everyone on the internet? Thank you for making this video party. I'm so excited to upload this one for you guys because of this video. We're going to be taking a look at one more romantic movie for the month of February. And honestly, this one's one of my personal favorite movies in general because it was actually based on a true story. And that would be The Big Sick. So this movie was released back in 2017 and it stars Kumail Nanjiani who's starting to become one of my favorite actors because he knows how to deliver humor in unexpected moments. Anyway, The Big Sick was written by and based off Kumail and his wife Emily's relationship where we have this Pakistani comic meet an American graduate student during a one night stand but then begin to form a relationship with each other. However for Kumail his parents have always pressured him into having an arranged marriage with a Pakistani woman in order to respect their heritage and culture. And while Kumail has always been against arranged marriage he's never told his parents about Emily because if he tells them that he's dating a white girl his parents will disown him. To make things worse he's never told Emily about all the women that his parents try to set him up with and when she finds out it eventually leads to a breakup. Later on in the film Emily develops an unknown sickness and needs immediate medical attention with her parents nowhere to be seen Kumail takes responsibility as Emily's husband and gives the doctors permission in order to put her into a coma so that they can treat her right away. While Emily is in a coma, her parents arrive who are both played by Holly Hunter and Ray Romano and are in the same hospital with the guy she broke up with. There's only one word that can describe this. Awkward! But as the movie goes on, after several funny jokes, including one cafeteria joke that caught me by surprise, Emily's parents soon accept Kumel and understand some of the struggles he faces with his parents and how others perceive him. Now while Kumel is able to make amends with Emily's parents and with Emily after she comes out of her coma, he still has to confront his own parents and confess to all the things that he's been hiding from them and this is something that a lot of us can relate to. At some point in our lives we've all had to talk to our parents where we've had to make some sort of confession about some certain struggles that we're facing with, whether it's about school, work, or even your love life. I also like how this movie emphasizes the idea that no good can come from hiding things from the people around you because if you do you're just adding more weight onto your shoulders and eventually things are going to come crashing down on you but if you trust the people around you they can lift some of that burden off your shoulders so overall i really love this movie and i love that it was based on kumail and emily's life because we really get to see the kind of struggles they faced in their relationship one other thing that makes this movie rewatchable is the humor that kumail nanjiani brings to this movie knowing that he's a comedian and watch him add some lighthearted jokes in a movie based on a very important moment in his life it just makes the movie much more special so if you're looking for something to watch on amazon and you're in the mood for a good romantic biopic that is very lighthearted, you should definitely check out this movie well that's gonna do it for this video guys that was my overall view for the big sick if you like what you saw click the subscribe button so you can get the latest updates from this channel i'll see you next time with a brand new video Bye bye